Why do we always come here? I guess we'll never know. It's like a kind of torture to have to watch the show. Hello everyone, here is Season again, and I'm doing another 2v2, again on Gold Showdown, and I'm doing another dual cast, but this time with my clan leader and friend Bewas. How are you doing? Good, thank you, Season. Hello, everyone. Yeah, do you want to introduce yourself, or do you think you're just plain boring and all that stuff? I'm just plain boring, like everyone says, I suppose. Yeah, they only talk about your voice, and I think it's not too bad. But we'll let the people decide that. Yay! Okay. And if you flame him, I'm gonna so report you and totally kick your ass. So, anyway. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. Um, we've got a 2v2 on Girls Showdown, as I said. And, um, the teams are probably Maniac and Happy Hardcore. As Happy Hardcore is Michael, and they're in the same clan. So... Um, it's going to be on the left side, Happy Hardcore as Green Allies and um, Maniac, or Maniac, but I'll call him Maniac, just because that sounds cooler, as Blue Allies on the bottom left. So, who do we have on the other team and on the right, viewers? On the right hand side, we have Kivi as Orange Soviets, and at the bottom right, we have Rise the Cobra, who is Red Allies. Yeah. So, um, as Digital pointed out, it's uh, usually better to have different factions on your team. Even though he and Maestro played a lot of games as double allies, so I don't get that one really well. But anyway, um, I think we should start this up. So, start up in 3, 2, 1. Okay. So, we're starting off with... Um, how was it going? TV's going for our barracks. Yeah, let's let's do that. Uh, Rise of the Cobra, was he? And he's one enough and doing a barracks, and so is everyone else. Maniac, and so is yeah everyone else actually. Okay, why are all they why are they all doing the same? And they're all building a power plant next. Yep. And a ref already for the so if you got a Giffy. Giffy, get Kiffy, Giffy, Giffy. And let's go on Giffy. Yeah, let's go on Giffy. And then now we have Animal Wars. Yeah. Right, well, we have PK Wars. Exactly. Just wanted to say that. At top we have the bear, dogs, man. Kiffy's obviously winning because he has about seven <laughs> bears. Yeah. And um. I was gonna say something, but I just forgot it. Oh yeah, did you know that uh, Kiffy, yes. if you would spell it with a W, which obviously you wouldn't, is the Dutch word for some kind of fruit. So, or a kiwi. Yeah, is that in English too? Never mind. Yes. Oh, Phil. <laughs> Phil's hex. Oh my god. Anyway, yeah, I'm so gonna edit it out or not. Probably not. I'm too lazy. So we've got um, peacekeepers staring each other to death, and uh, yeah, he's going for a war factory. Well, uh, so right, the cobra's gone for an airfield. The maniac's gone for war factory. Yes, indeed. And uh, hardcore was still waiting for. Uh, he's gone for an airfield as so well. So they're kind of um, the um, the end team. So the left side is exactly countering the right side. This is kind of neat, actually. And Rise the Kyra is countering Maniac. He is, but mm, no, he's not. And there's. Looks like there's going to be a huge animal war up the top. Whoa, a lot of doggies. Happy Hardcore takes out two conscripts. And they're all countering, and the, did the War Factory just die? What? <laughs> Yeah, Maniac sold his war factory. Why did he do that? Because Rise of the Cobra has gone for an airfield and the Vindicator is just tearing up his IFEs. Yeah, but you can spam IFEs. Yeah, but it's not the most, I don't know, best thing to do. 
No, no, no. And my watch is going off. Nice. The last time I did airfield against an LS guy and he did War Factory, I got totally owned. But, you know, I'm a noob, so that's... Oh, hardcore, hardcore's lost the Vindicator. Yeah, he just did. And there's a ref for um, Happy Hardcore. That's a turret. Yeah, but he's... Yeah, now it's a turret. <laughs> um, but ref got up first. And uh, only one Vindicator to counter three bullfrogs. Mm, no, that's not going to happen. <laughs> Why does he have more things? Bye, still. Well, he lost one earlier, and he just lost another one now. Yeah, that's... Yeah, but and still... If you have to look down at the uh, bottom yeah. right corner, I just... he's got Maniac trying to cry for rush, but it's not going too good. Oh, there's the cryo. I didn't notice the cryo yet. If he moves his cryo over there, frozen half -star. Oh, he just got a half so frozen before after the bomb by... That's uh well at least he froze his account in part of his economy for a little bit. Kitty's now harassing Happy Hardcore. Yes he Happy is. Hardcore decides to deploy his prospect. Yeah, that's the probably a good idea because then you have belt radius back in your base. And the uh, sickle has gone down. It did. So there's yep. no harassment more anymore. No, nope, unless bullfrogs can kill harvesters, I don't think so. Yeah, okay. So, um, I just noticed, um, I put a uh, uh, path for the video files on a different hard drive, and I'm having way faster game right now. I'm running on 30 fraps almost all the time, so that's probably not going to be any syncing, just so everyone knows. Okay. <clears throat> Might be for three seconds or something, though. And the Apollo's dying, or not, not dying. Not really. Yeah, but almost. One but Maniacs song. might if he leaves in death too long, but he gets it out in time. Yeah, well, you know what's kind of funny? Usually you get the left bottom guy to the right bottom guy, and now it's the left bottom guy to the right top guy. <laughs> Which yeah. is kind of <laughs> well, They're all kind of massing in the middle. Yeah. And now there's so Minix not careful, forces. he's going to lose his MCV, but he gets out early enough. Who does? Maniac, in the uh, middle. Oh yeah, yeah, he's backing it up. There you we go, he's moving away, I think. And uh, Happy Hardcore looks like he's about to take out the Soviet refinery. Yeah, I was noticing the Jeffries earlier. And uh, as you can see, this barrack will no longer block the refinery. He's even laser locked into Apollo. Managed to take one out as well. But sadly, pay eat all. Yeah. Nice kaboom, there goes Ref. And it's an heroic Jeffy and an not heroic Jeffy, but it's it. And there goes one Apollo. And there goes Lost Jeffy. Nice, nice. And he's got a Berg, so he might have just enough range to get the Ref back up. Yeah. Oh, if not, his MTV will give him range. Oh, yeah. Uh, I didn't notice the MTV. Orbital drop on the airfield there. Almost takes out. Where? It's up or... In the happy, happy Hardcore's base. Oh, yeah, it's not here yet. So you might want to stop for, like... Yeah, it's happening now, so you might want to stop for like 5 to 10 seconds. Okay. And it's not even barely dead. It can be barely dead. It's not can, even really can dead. Can I play now? Yeah, I guess you can play now. So he lost one Vindicator. Yeah, he lost yeah. one Vindicator, but he killed a Bullfrog. Though I don't yeah. think that's, that's not cost effective, right? And he's now spamming turrets. If he's who oh, his guarding tank gets frozen, his turrets are oh, light shit. blue. Death. And now one from your Death. maniac can that. And frozen. their drones infecting a riptide and all kind of stuff happening. And oh, he's freezing back. Ouch. 
I think I'm still ahead. Yeah, then just stop for a little bit more. Yeah, the uh, second free trade did way more damage. Definitely. And now there's air coming in and other air coming in and air dying and it's all one big mess, guy. And my watch keeps going off for some strange reason. Just put it off. I can't. I uh, don't know how. Well then... And uh, some Paul is fighting now. Uh, where? In the happy hardcore space. Oh yeah, that's done. So you're kind of behind. But I'm kind of lagging now, so you could probably just keep running and get back. Okay. Looks like Kivy and uh, Happy Article are kind of waiting for each other to attack. Yeah, but uh, Kivy has... No, he doesn't. I was going to say he had more economy, but they're exactly the same. No, Kivy has um, <coughs> almost complete control of the middle. And everyone expanded to the side uh, and top uh, expansions, and, uh, yeah. except for the guys at the bottom. And uh, also, both players, KV and Happy Hardcore, are taking up at the exact same time. Yeah. Yeah. Happy nice. Hardcore is going for his um, maximum clearance, okay. and KV is going for his battle base, which is now done. Yes, it is. And so is the maximum clearance. Nice. So we're going to see Epic Tier 3 Battles. And uh, if you have a look at the bottom, yeah. Rise of the Cobra is pushing in onto Maniac's oh, base. Oh, Freeze Ray, Freeze Ray, Freeze Ray didn't do anything at all. Well, in close to dark. But these peace keeps doing a lot of damage and they've all just been run over. Yeah, but one killed a Guardian. True. And another and Freeze, freeze Ray. Ray. And why are they using two Guardians for Lace Luck? Bad Micro. I so own them. Nah, probably not. So, no, um. Gun run. What? You're just trying to copy the gun run. Bad micro. Yeah, I don't care. Um. It was bad micro, so I think I can copy that. Whatever. Yeah. And, uh, if you have a look at the uh, bottom right bridge, Peace keeps are firing at nothing. Yeah, he's probably trying to kill the bridge for some reason. But it's kind of missing. <laughs> yeah. Target the house. And uh, looks like he's got some artillery wars over here at the top right corner. Yeah, and uh, if he exterminated. And uh, also got a spy mixed in, disguised as a flak tree for oh, his Oh, yeah, that's nice. Oh, no, it's, uh, oh, it's just turned into the flak tree. I've got two mirages. Oh, and he managed to get these apox. Oh, and... that was bad dude whoa the vx just killed two mirages the spy died yeah but he did get an apoc and two flex with percent and sickle i suppose so that's and pretty good see natasha as well and a small group of flax yeah and whoa uh, that's not a small group really and he froze the vx but he wasn't in time to kill it Oh, that's just too bad. There aren't any VXs in this game, though. Did you say VX? I meant V4. Oh. Oh, you know, why is he... Oh, my God. Why was he stop my green deflect to us? Kill Natasha. Yeah, but one Bindi can't kill Natasha. He might as well just kill the flex. So some oh. reptiles can come in and clear out Natasha a bit more that's ease. fine, then. And uh, if we also have a look at the bottom, we've got some Mirage tanks and Garden tanks fighting it out, but oh, nice. looks like Rise of the Cobras will prevail. Yeah, and we've got a Tanya! Nice Tanya drop. And the uh, Spy Natasha. <coughs> Where? In the uh, Happy Hardcore's expansion. Spy Natasha? Where? Oh no! Yeah, she just... Uh transformed and Natasha almost died to doggies no don't send them in one by one that's not gonna work and freezing and it's gonna epically fail what are you talking about <coughs> Natasha almost got frozen oh she just got by the mirage 
You're probably a tiny drop in this. If he's yeah. not careful, he's going to lose his MCV. No, uh, we're saying that's it out. gonna die. Oh my god! And uh, we've also got KV pushing in with his V4s, taking out some turrets. Okay, why is he? Fu isn't he f dropping Tanya? There goes Tanya! And doggies, and they're gonna. Where's she? I'm okay. ahead of you again. I guess so. Uh, just pause it for a bit. No, move away, Ramsey V, you noob! Oh, she died! Go Mirages. Go fucking Mirages. And another Tanya, the blue Tanya. What the hell? Why are there so many Tanyas? Because That's why she was like over nerfed. That. What the hell, guys? Don't give me wrong information. No, they just made it so that it's harder to get Tanya. Yeah, but people said it was over nerfed. Which I clearly disagree with. Same. I'm gonna start mine again. Yeah. And Rush is getting killed by. Apex and one Apex getting bribed. No, don't put it in that mode. Oh, you noob. Oh, yeah, he managed to get one Apex guy. Yeah, but he should have, should have. Um, and the Apex takes that out of Apex from the rear. Oh my god, that was bad. And Tanya coming in and killing everything. Yeah. That's yeah, okay. Goes down. Um. Uh, I don't remember who it was, but the one I fought with, I think the sign of that? Could be. I don't know. I don't remember. But the guy that failed at the time and drop, this is how you need to do it. Kaboom! Super Reactor. Epic Massacre. Boom. Boom, 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 baby. There goes the refinery. Yes, he does. Does he still have his MCV? Yeah, he's, he does have his MCV, though. But he's it's got no anyway. isn't it? Yeah, it's all the way at the bottom of the little island thing in the middle. Next to a naval yard. Interesting. Yeah, he's going for Stingray. Oh, and if we also have like a Maniac base, there's a tiny drop there. Dude, and a lot of things. He sells his MCV. Maniac sells his MCV. That's kind of weird. And he's freezing two airfields at once. And that's bad. And then Seven Mirage is just own tiny completely. Yeah, guys, you need seven mirages. Nah, you don't. And, uh. We've also got another Tanya up in the top right corner still. Yeah. And that's doing a lot of damage. Game changing, you know. And, uh, if we can have a look at the bottom, Kivy's Navy Yards has just gone down. And we see a Spectrum Tower from Rise of the Coat. Yeah, it's almost down. Now it's down. And Spectrum Tower gonna totally own everything. And I'm ahead of you again. Yeah, but well, it's less bad than it was in other games. Kaboom, there goes Ref, and she's getting owned by Peacekeeper. Oh, no, she isn't anymore. No, get the fuck out of there. Mirage killing you. Oh, my God, and raped. What the hell? Oh, never mind, not raped. No, it's raped. So, almost dead Apollos, and another Tanya. Atanya, Atanya, what is an Atanya? Tanya spam fast. Yeah, but tsunamis are waiting out, so he'll have to put her on the top. Or what are you talking about tsunamis for? What tsunamis? You said tsunamis. Shit, I hate this. I was trying to say mirages. And these people are still firing at the bridge doing nothing. Yeah. Shut and, uh, stuff. Maniac has got all of his Mirage tanks. Looks like they're all going to go in. And we see another Tanya from Rise of the Cobra. And that's a fuckload of Mirages on both sides. And Maniac's going in, but he's sending them in one by one. And IFE does some damage to it. Oh my god. Oh my god. That just happened for me, but, you know, it's not that bad. And, uh, anyway. Um, and we've got a new MCV! Yay! And another Rafina cannon. Well, well, well. Oh dear. <laughs> Looks like it's gonna take out the Spectrum Tower and this naval yard again. Gaboom. There goes the Spectrum. And uh, we've also got. And we've got a frozen grain and it's dead! And two frozen hammerings and all kind of dead stuff. And another Spectrum Tower going down. 
No, arm's going down. Oh, he lost his Athena. And that's Mirage as well. Yeah, but, you know, they did Not kill me. a lot of stuff. And there goes Mirage. We have another time here as dying well. Dying it, dying it, rip, dying it, rip, there we go. Yeah, and but that's going to get totally owned. Kaboom, there she goes. And the sentry is dying for no reason. And big freeze, oh my god. Did he hit the, uh, if you manage to freeze the MCV, apparently it stays there for 16 minutes, like, so he frozen. Yeah, but it's going to be frozen with two tier trees, so that's not going to happen. Uh, and the sentry bomb only just about makes an escape. And if we have a look at the bottom, it looks like Maniacs just lost. Oh my god, that's a lot of stuff to lose. Three Mirages and Ivy. Okay, he just froze his own Guardian and more Mirages and... What the hell? No, don't move away, you can kill him now! Oh my god, these guys can learn so much from you. <coughs> from me or you? <coughs> um, both of us, probably. <laughs> okay. Okay, and we've got a spy dog. That's a dog that's been drawing some frogs in the old base of Kifi. Spy dogs are awesome. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, look at the speed it's going. Relax and mellow and stuff. <laughs> that's kind of nice. Presumably the spy's going to take some money from that refinery. Definitely. And he killed two Harveys, so that's kind of nice. Big ego harassment. No, keep firing. He takes that money. Your Mirage is gonna die anyway, so you should keep firing at stuff. Or it's not gonna die. There it goes. If you have a look in the top left corner, Kivi sending some hammer tanks and a flak trooper to go and take out something. That's not there. Well, he was trying to get his uh, thing back. Ref. And a lot of Guardians and Mirages almost going in. And another giant drop ready. Okay, this is just too many tiny drops. But you know, if you've got the uh, Defense Bureau, it doesn't many anymore. It's not really that costly. Because you, if you make a Defense Bureau, you probably have enough refs to support it. Yeah. And the okay. team is killing the Mirage, and the Mirage are trying to kill the MCV, and are they gonna succeed? Yes, they did. The cannon just takes out quite a bit as well. Yes, they do. All three of them. And Mirage is getting killed, though. Yeah, all oh. the Mirage has died. Oh, wait, he's got more. What the hell? So a lot of Mirage has died. I think that was a pretty cost-effective attack. Rise of the Code release attack now before Maniac can build up his stuff again. Yeah. Since he has no war factory as well. Push that advantage, everyone. Push that advantage. Yeah, he has to rebuild it. I'm not sure where he's actually taking his Mirage tanks. Yeah. But it's giving Maniac time to build up. And he has no nothing left except for an airfield, so... Yeah, he's trying to attack Happy Hardcore, I guess. And he's doing a tank drop combined with it. Which is always a good idea. If That's you do a tank drop, you shoot, kind of distract stuff. Yeah, but the tank drops a bit too much, along with all that force. Yeah, but if the f he doesn't have to run the force in, if he just um, attacks the spectrum tower with the Athena, which won't probably die, then he. Why the Apollos take out Tanya? Oh, oh yeah, I see. Nice. Why was he doing Tanya there? So he can take out Maniac's economy, making it easier for Kivi to kill him, I suppose. Yeah. Well, oh, he's tier 3 again. Kivi is tier 3 again. And by the looks of Kivi, might be turret pushing his expansion, or not? I'd... Or maybe his base. Oh, we have a freeze on all the Mirage tanks. Oh, you know what would be epically funny? If, um... Kifi moved his MV across the bridge and the bridge was killed because that's going to be one shot at by a lot of stuff. And we've got freeze ray and that's freezing a lot of stuff and things dying and 
Oh my god. There's an aircraft carrying the EMP. There is! Whoa, that did massive damage with the EMP. When yeah. it did damage, but it froze a lot of stuff. Yeah. And there's still a frozen Mirage tank there, and that goes down as well. We have some drones and a spy. Yeah, what did I f that spy just got an IV, that's not really... <laughs> we've that's... also got a naval yard from Maniac as well. And we've got the aircraft carrier being attacked by the... Oh, that's just died. Ouch. What, from the... Oh yeah, the APOC. Oh, and Rise of the Cobra just um, probably agreed with... Um, um, not Happy Oka. With Giffy to give up because he got gave, gave all his base. Looks like we've got a and spy fee as well here. Yeah. Oh, that's too bad. Okay, you should have a twin blade. Yeah, what Kiffy should do with his allied base is sell the defense defense bureau. Did you just see that APOC take out the aircraft carrier? Oh, and did he do another one? Yeah, yeah it's because it was close to short, it just like kind of was looked like it just shot it really. Yeah. Pretty epic. Yeah. And we have a dreadnought. It's now frozen. Yeah, there it almost there it I get there it goes. What I was what I was gonna say was that he should sell his uh defense bureau which he got from uh, the right the rise of the cobra. Yeah. Because you know, he doesn't have a barracks so you can't do anything with that. I suppose That's probably the reason that um um Rise of the Cobra gave up anyway. And uh also if you have a look at the right hand corner we have the super reacts about to go down. Wait, you mean in the expansion thing? Yeah. Yeah that Almer already died. Just oh. died. Yeah, but you were ahead with something else and it's <laughs> weird. And some flying Apox as well. Yeah, I saw them. And they killed stuff? Yeah, they killed Athena. And they're harpooning one Mirage and they're not gonna be able to re to the harpoon the other one, but you know. Neat, neat, neat. Um and the fans just got sold and the place is getting owned and he's gonna be low power at this raid. And the humanity of it all. Kaboom, kaboom, kaboom. There's also an orbital drop. Oh yeah, I just saw it. Fortunately, it doesn't take anything out. Yeah, well, unfortunately. We also got some V4s, which got taken out by the aircraft carrier as well. Not yet. It looks like a second super reactor will be going down as well. Not to mention all the other power plants near it. Yeah. Papu. It's gonna be kaboom, and there goes one rush. But, you know, he's gonna be low power right now. Yeah, but he's rebuilding two super reactors at the same time. And opposite sides of his base. If you take a super reactor, or if you're making two, you should, I guess, put them next to each other because if one booms, the other one booms. But, you know, you don't get that your whole base is destroyed. You do know there's a video of about nine super reactors exploding at the same time. Yeah. I exploded three uh, super reactors at the same time with our control lead. Oh, and okay, he's just going to lose two V4s. Oh, he lost only one to and a spy. And he's going to lose a uh, Dreadnought to a uh, Tanya, and the Tanya is dying. Or not. Yeah, there she goes. Kaboom. Well, not kaboom, but you know. Oh, the spy kept it there before. That's probably what you said, but I don't care. Um, anyway. VXs attacking each other, and that should move right now, and the other one isn't moving, so that's gonna die, and kaboom. Nice. You do know that they're V4s, not VXs. Why do I keep saying VXs? Because VXs are OP. <laughs> Probably. Anyway. Um, Apollos and Mix protecting the Twin Blades with the Apoch drop. And Mirage is dying, and Kiffy is doing a really good job. And he should get the fuck off with the APOC. No, he lost an almost heroic APOC. That's painful. That's a okay. good use of spies in this game. 
Yeah, I'm gonna say that Giffy is dead. He was probably dead a long time ago, but you know, now he's completely dead. He's not gonna survive this for long. And if he is gonna win, then I'm gonna give him a medal. I don't. I know we don't have those anymore, but I'm gonna make AGM get it back. Give him a cookie. Yeah, that that too. Oh, the Apoc surf. No, um, he didn't survive. He got the and This is just absolute wordage at the minute. Yeah, it is. Yeah, but he's Super getting attacked by two guys and no Super Reactor is going down. Oh, that goes. Almost. And. Kaboom! Okay. And the second Super Reactor goes. Ooh! So. That's okay, painful. Perfect. Okay, don't say it if it's game over. Anyway, my frame rate just dropped to 18, so you're going to be ahead of me by a long time. Okay. And everything dying, and I don't know why Kiffy isn't giving up. I would have rage quit it by now. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> you knew that. Um. Anyway, he died, and we've get, got the girl with the big boobs. Which I still prefer to call the lady with the big boobs, but I don't care. Anyway, um, yeah, units aren't really interesting. Neither are structures. Just that you can see that Giffy was going with wee woom, wee woom. Which sounds pretty serious. But um, resource-wise, you can see that Giffy was going yay, yay, or yay, yay, yay. You yeah. worry me sometimes. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> anyway, um, Maniac had, well, the best economy for a little bit. I don't know. We'll see that at the average income per minute. Yay, yeah, if he had the best income. Definitely. <coughs> but it was like... Maniac is most efficient. <coughs> yes, yeah, by far. Followed by Rise of the Cobra and then Happy Out Corn and Giddy. Yeah. Giffy, you suck. No, I'm just kidding. Um, and it was 26 minutes, so I'm not going to be able to put this in one part. So, um, this is probably part two for you guys. Um, well, probably, definitely. Anyway. <coughs> Sorry, something stuck in my throat or something. It's fine for you. <coughs> no. I have had that. Um, anyway. No, I didn't. But um, yeah, the I was gonna say the game changing event was Tanya, but you won't know which one it would be then, probably. No, because that's about ten Tanyas in that game. Yeah, but the first one from I guess Maniac. Yeah, Maniac. That was heroic and we killed about who the whole of Giffy's base and two refs and another part of his base on the uh, middle was definitely game changing. I mean if that would have killed would have been killed really fast then that wouldn't have um then Giffy might have stood a chance. Don't forget about <coughs> happy hardcore spies as well. Yeah, they were game chasing too. Spies are really OP. Nah probably not, but you know. Kind of. Yeah, kind of. We need a Soviet spy like thing. Like a KGB agent. We need female. Just like Moblin said. Yeah, Moblin. He was awesome. Anyway, what I was going to say is that this is probably a sign up. Do you have anything you want to say about the game? Not really. Anything about other stuff you want to say? Not really either. Okay, then it's a sign up. So um, we'll see you on the battlefield. Good night, everyone. Later. Uh